Hi everybody, <laughs> we are out squatching today. Right now we're at the Otis Reservoir in Otis, Mass. And we want you to please avoid nesting loons. Operate slowly, thank you. Which, because I'm a knucklehead, I always operate slowly. I was talking to this gentleman here, putting his boat in, if he caught anything today. And he said, I caught a couple. So Otis Reservoir, there's fish activity, people are getting them. Uh, Colebrook Reservoir, not so much. Check it out, let's go check out this loon. Big reservoir, huh? For this area of the lake, wherever the country has it. Uh... He's having a lot of fun today. Have a nice day, sir. Um, so, Massachusetts. Um, some of you people out there, we came from Connecticut, but look at what they have here. They have an outdoor recreation map. That would really make our investigating a lot easier. We're going to get up here to the Quabbin Reservoir someday. That's cool. All this is, is forested and protected. These are all access gates. Um, yeah. There's a nice little place. I'm not even going to tell you about my secret place. I'm going to keep the secret. I got a little place that I go to up there. Um, but this is the campground. Surrounded by Otis Reservoir, and uh, these are all on the water. And we were, <laughs> we just camped, uh, we just left this morning from Lake Waramog. We camped Saturday, and today is Sunday, and uh, the 29th of August, about 3 30. Uh, I really wish we had camped here because uh, it's really quiet. Of course, it did rain, and we were able to go home and make us some slamming cheeseburgers. We, you don't get a squatch belly by accident, but this place, this is much more of a, a quiet outdoorsy campground than like Waramog, which is geared more towards recreation. You get a lot of New York overflow. But this place is quiet. So that's all, you know, that Waramog's fun. Um, if you have a family and, and you want to cut back, but this is if you want to get quiet and woodsy and go do some fishing, this is the place.